Why bluefin tuna are so expensive. Before we start, I don't want you to hit that red subscribe button so that you never miss out on any of our videos. What you need to know about the fish. Bluefin are the largest tunas and can live up to 40 years. They migrate across all oceans and can dive deeper than 3,000 feet. Bluefin tuna are made for speed. Built like torpedoes, have retractable fins, and their eyes are set flush to their body. They are tremendous predators from the moment that they hatch, seeking out schools of fish like herring, mackerel, and even eels. They hunt by sight and have the sharpest vision of any bony fish. There are three species of bluefin, Atlantic, the largest and the most endangered, Pacific, and Southern. Most catches of the Atlantic bluefish tuna are taken from the Mediterranean Sea, which is the most important bluefin tuna fishery in the world. The fish is reputable for commanding ridiculously outrageous prices at auctions. For example, in 2019, CNN reported that Kiyoshi Kimiro, the self-proclaimed Japanese tuna king, paid a record-breaking $3.1 million for a 612-pound bluefin tuna. That breaks down to nearly $5,065 per pound, and some seriously expensive sushi rolls. Whether a fish is worth that much is a matter of opinion. Kimura even admitted that he overpaid. But what is it that makes bluefin tuna so incredibly pricey? Limited supply and exporting costs drive up the price. One factor that makes bluefin tuna so expensive is the law of supply and demand. To put it bluntly, there's only so much bluefin tuna in the ocean. All three species of the bluefin are overfished and the fish don't breed in captivity. Japan, the largest consumer of bluefin, has faced international criticism for its harsh fishing of bluefin. It wasn't always this way, either. The fish didn't really become popular until after the 1970s, when sushi slowly began to gain following in the West. The fish has a fatty marbling which makes the meat from its belly incredibly prized for sushi. Japan is simply better at handling the butchering of bluefin. It's not uncommon for bluefin caught off the United States coast to be sent to Japan before being exported to a sushi restaurant someplace else. This drives up the cost. You won't find bluefin in a canned fish aisle of the grocery store. To the uninformed, tuna might just be tuna, and the idea of paying millions for a 600-pound fish seems ludicrous. It's important to note, though, that the bluefin sushi roll you might get at a high-end sushi restaurant has very little in common with your mom's tuna salad recipe. It completely depends upon where you get it from, but it's never cheap. A local bluefin on the East Coast will run anywhere between $20 and $40 a pound. You could be paying north of $200 a pound for bluefin from Japan. According to Wilcox, tuna from Japan is better than American tuna during the peak winter months. While Boston tuna is the best during the summer and the fall, but it's the tuna that comes from Oma in Japan that's widely considered to be some of the best in the world. The heights prices in Japan is caused by the hands it has to pass through. Another reason fish is more expensive is because it has further to travel, and it goes through a rather lengthy process before making its way to your plate. There's more hands that it passes through in Japan, which is not necessarily a bad thing, the fish is also handled better in Japan than the US, so there's less damage and more precise cutting. Boston bluefish goes from the fisherman, to the distributor, to our door. Whereas in Japan, it's going from the fisherman, usually to a collective or cooperative, to the governments that's running the auction, to a middle wholesaler, to a final wholesaler, to a restaurant or a hotel. All high-end fish are auctioned in Japan. Fish that's more sought after, that's caught in a better place, that's handled better, that's clearly better quality will go for a higher price, and that fishermen will get more of the money. The high prices has also caused the difficulty in getting the fish. Bluefish tuna is expensive because it's in such high demand in Japan. According to why tuna is both cheap and expensive, plentiful and very endangered, a bluefin tuna caught off a Long Island goes straight to Japan, where a 500 pound fish can sell as much as $1.8 million. As Japan demand increases, Fewer bluefin reach breeding age, potentially significantly reducing populations through overfishing. Should bluefin populations crash, prices could skyrocket again. To improve breeding stock and keep a steady supply of bluefin, tuna ranchers and other aquaculturists are working to establish sea farms where schools of tuna are raised in the open ocean and then herded to market. That's all for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel so that you never miss any amazing video from us.